And guess what? Time for Furry Friend mm -hmm. Finder, where we help a four-legged friend for a forever home, Sandra DeFeo, from the Executive Director of the Humane Society of New York. And tell us about Archie. Oh, Archie, isn't he sweet? Oh, my he gosh. He's, I call him 150% sugar, but he's 100% chihuahua. <laughs> and he's only five pounds. And only five pounds and a year old. Aww. So, well, five pounds and a little bit of change. So okay. yeah, it's yeah. possible even you know, at a year old, he might mm -hmm. go up to six, but no more than that. At this point, we know this is his weight. So he's just very sweet. He I love is. his ears. I just love it. He's got a great <laughs> voice. What's his temperament like, his personality? Well, his, his personality is very demure. He's very oh, okay. sweet. He does like other little dogs and oh, plays with them. Oh, thank goodness. Them. That's good. Um, he's using the wee wee pads because he doesn't like really those loud noises of the city. Yeah. And we're on 59th Street, and there's yeah. a lot of trucks and sounds like that. So when he goes out, he enjoys the air. But if there's a big noise, he's not interested in doing you right. know, his business. <laughs> or whatever. So he's good with other small dogs. How yep. about big dogs? Um, a case by case. Okay. I mean, if it's a very sweet natured dog mm -hmm. and he doesn't feel threatened, he'd be fine. What about you know, kids? Um, well, again, I think older children probably are best, um, not little ones that are very excitable and, and maybe do a lot of ah, screaming and stuff like that would be alarming for How him. about cats? It's possible he's okay with the, if, the right kind of cat. Yeah. Um, but, you know, you just always want to be careful with the chihuahuas and the pugs and all those animals with the eyes that pop a little. Because if a cat takes a swat, oh. then they have an eye injury. Right. So, but, you know, it depends, case by case. How but unlike a pug or a French bulldog, he's not going to snore. No. Right. No snoring. Right. He has yeah. a very good nose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and how did he come to you? Um, someone who couldn't take care of him Aww. and he needed a little bit of building up uh -huh. and um, yeah so now he's definitely built up and he's ready to be adopted and he's just a year old five pounds hello we're he's hoping maybe department if he dog. goes to a house like Reggie did where they have the yard he might go out and yeah. learn how to be housebroken like that yeah. otherwise he's using a wee wee but pad. you know to be in a TV studio with all the lights and all the movement mm -hmm. during the breaks there's lots of noise yeah. he doesn't seem to no. be that stressed I mean look at him no. of course he's being held and loved by Cindy Shue, so yeah. Well, oh, well he's wearing his little day. sweater, though, because if it's too cold, then he shakes a little. Well, That's what Chihuahuas so do, do to warm up. Yeah. <laughs> well, they're terrific. Yeah. I have a, I have a, a Chihuahua dog. mix, and I love her to death. Aww. So I'm hoping someone sees him today. I know, and speaking of, we have a furry friend finder update. Wally, the two-month-old pit bull puppy. Remember this little guy? Yes, yes. Softest puppy I've ever yeah. felt. Has found his forever home. When Patricia and Christopher first saw him here on Furry Friend Finder. Oh my gosh. They knew he was the one. Wally now lives in New Jersey with his new family and big brother. That big brother was Django, a six-year-old Saint Bernard. Wow. Wally loves playing with his toys exploring and napping. <laughs> Aww, so cute. It really so is cute. all about the fit. Yeah. It's just that perfect fit. And then it's like you say, whether it's cats or dogs mm -hmm. or kids. Well, there's two cats in that house. Yeah. Um, Suki and Cash, and they, they, you know, everybody they, gets along. Everybody gets along. Aww. Yeah. Love it. Well, hopefully we're going to have a furry friend finder on Archie. For Archie. Yeah. Okay. We hope so. So. Now, for more information on furry friend finder, just head to our website, cbsnewyork.com. We'll be right back.